Good morning, folks. Hey, it's a pretty day out here. The pollen's real heavy. I've been working out in the yard, cutting down trees and stuff like that. Um, so excuse my voice. It's nothing bad. It's just pollen. Today, I want to talk about my favorite bait to catch a bluegill and shell cracker. Um, and that's a squirrel tail jig. And uh, this jig is approximately one one twenty eighth of an ounce. That the head is the actual jig, real light. It has a number eight um, mustad hook in it, and that squirrel tail right there has been dyed with a hair dye. Here on Gunnersville Lake, we have an aquatic vegetation. Actually, two primary aquatic vegetations that is uh, milfoil and hydrilla and there's a lot of leeches and they're black that lives in it and that's the reason I believe they hit it so well because bluegill and shellcracker both eat leeches um, now sometimes I'll trim a jig a little bit with my scissors I'll sort of put a V into it and I love to fish it with one or two pound test line which is a little bit extreme but I do that for the fun and sport of it um, with a real wimpy outfit that's how I like to to fish it hey I just hope y'all enjoy the video good morning folks hey no it's evening time I want you to look who I got with me right here now hey guys how you doing yeah we are having uh, a great time if you were wondering if is Richard as crazy as he seems <laughs> Yes, he is. <laughs> but so am I. So good. We make a good match. We're going to go out here and catch us some bluegill and shell cracker this afternoon. And we're going to do it using the old bait. Stay with us. See if there's one over that way. There we go. All right, we got us another one right here. But this one is no, no doubt a bluegill. And a good one. Not a gargantuan, but is that an eater? Yeah, yeah. All right, squirrel tail jig. Now these jigs is made by Mr. Perry, who owns four by four bass jigs. Um, the ultimate jig head, the one that we use a lot on this channel. And he handmade these. He found him a squirrel out in the middle of the road. Seriously, folks. Cut his tail off and made these jigs. That's what we do. That's how we roll. Let's put him in the bucket there, Elmo. <laughs> Look here. Well, John, I want you to look what a yellow perch. Now, you're talking about a good eating fish That's right my there. my very first yellow perch ever, man. Well, yeah. Yeah. Congratulations. Congratulations. That's Richard, a good. can I keep him? Yes, you may. There's no size limit or anything on him? No. Can nope. I eat him? You can eat him. And you're not going to be like a poisonous reason? No. You'll sir. Matter of fact, like after you eat him, where well, they're in the sauger family, they're in the perch family. Uh, after you eat him, you'll wish you caught about 40 more with him. Right there. They should be a bed right there. Yep, there he is. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a real good one. That could be a shell cracker. Look here. Yeah, it's a small shell cracker. But look how pretty they are. Do you, now, do you eat shell cracker? Yes. Yes. I like them a lot. <laughs> I like them a lot. Well, there's a pretty good one. You eat the sandwich, man. 
Now he's peeing now. Yeah, well maybe they're still on bed. Yep. Maybe, maybe we got some shell daddies in here there. It's a good one. A squirrel tail jig is an old, old bait, but there's just something about that that jig. See see how it's straight right there, folks? When I put it in the water, it spraddles out. And what I'm doing is making a cast and I'm letting it hit the bottom. Okay. And just working it back like you would a plastic worm on the bottom. Shellcracker can't stand that. Right in there is where they should be, right? Right there. There he is. Now, I believe this is a, I can't tell. It could be a shell daddy, but I believe it's a bluegill fish right here now. Got one pound line. You just got to let them do whatever. Yep. It's a bluegill. Let's check him and see if he's peeing. No. These are the late stages. They've, they've done, done their heaviest spawning and now they're off. But we're still catching a few. Yep. Let's watch him right here. I want to see if he puts a smile on his face. <laughs> yeah, it does put a smile on his face. He's not quite big enough. <laughs> they got another one right here. Fish is pulling. Well, about any fish on one pound line to pull, won't it, John? Yeah, Look here. Yeah, Mom, that's a good. I switched up. I switched up rods. I see them laying everywhere out there. That jig ain't gonna last no time. There we go. That one hit right on the outside edge of the bed. Yup. There we go. Let's put him in the bucket. Well, there you have it. A little bit about the squirrel tail jig. Um, I, I think it's a real good bait. Uh, like I've said, it catches the fish. Had a great time with the regular dude. Okay, he's just a normal, regular dude. Had a great time fishing with him. I think he's a great fella. Check his channel out. He tickles me to death, I'll tell you what. And, you know what? Holy bum! <clears throat> Feel that, that horse, okay, woo, it don't matter. Hey. <laughs> Remember, don't be different, you can, but call it good for you.